Hello everyone, my name is Yonut and today I'm going to show you how you can customize your email notifications on Shopify. For this example, I'm going to use a dark teal compact version with the image based fallback. I'm just going to head over to the files, dark teal, Shopify and compact version. First thing we'll need to do is upload our images to Shopify. So I'm going to head over to the Shopify admin, settings, files, and I'm just going to click upload files. Let's head over to our files, Shopify, compact images, and I'm just going to select all of this. Right. We're also going to use a custom logo, so let's upload that as well. All right, now let's just update the image pad. So I'm going to select this URL here. And I'm just going to open up my files. So let's open the find and replace function. And I'm just going to search for images slash and replace it with the URL I got. Let's just delete this last part here and replace in all open documents. All right. Now let's update the logo. Just want to make sure I got the new path here. So I'm going to search for logo.png. I'm just going to replace this with the custom URL I got. So paste it here and replace in all documents. All right. Just going to save this and let's see what we did. Just going to copy the code and head over to notifications. If you're not using the default notifications or you're using a different language than English, you might need to customize the templates a little bit. You can tell this from the revert to default button. So make sure you make a backup of the code. I'm just going to head over to shipping update, HTML email, and I'm just going to replace the code here and click preview. All right, there's our new logo. Just going to save this. All right, let's update the plain text version as well. I'm just going to go to Shopify folder, plain text and shipping update. Select all plain text tab, paste, let's preview it. All right, and click save. So that's it for this tutorial. If you have any questions, write them in the comment area. Till next time, this is your note signing off. Bye.